War Diary Day 543 of Russia's war against Ukraine. In 2014, I stood in a cornfield in the middle of nowhere in eastern Ukraine, looking at the remains of their Malaysia MH17. I saw aircraft engines and wheels and kerosene oil and dead bodies being dumped into the back of a lorry and aircraft seats and luggage and ladies hats and trunkies, those little um, wheelie suitcases, mum and dad, um, tools, toddlers and all. This was the wreckage of a terrorist attack by the Russian state in which 298 people, entirely innocent, were shot out of the sky. I went on to challenge Vladimir Putin about this um, in person and we made a panorama. This is when I was at the BBC and um, our team, myself, great Nick Sturdy, um, and I, we found two Ukrainian eyewitnesses who met the Russian officer with this book missile. He spoke Russian with a Moscow accent. And with the permission uh, of my sources, I told the Dutch police about it. The reason I'm telling you about this is yesterday, the Dutch have said we are going to give 41 of our F-16s, all of them, to the Ukrainians. And the Danish said, and we're going to give all 19 of our F-16s. That's, I think, 61 F-16s in all. This may change the war. Probably not this year, but next year. The arc of justice is working. Fingers crossed. Vladimir Putin, do fuck off.